built a nation where there was none and made us proud to be Singaporean. We won't see another man like him. To many Singaporeans, and indeed others too, Lee Kuan Yew was Singapore. As Prime Minister, he pushed us hard to his successes with wisdom and tact. In his old age, he continued to keep a watchful eye on Singapore. Singapore was his abiding passion. He gave of himself in full measure to Singapore. As he himself put it towards the end of his life, and I quote, I have spent my life, so much of it, building up this country. There's nothing more that I need to do. I'm grieved beyond words at the passing of Mr. Lee Kuan Yew. I know that we all feel the same way. But even as we mourn his passing, let us also honor his spirit. Let us dedicate ourselves as one people to build on his foundations, strive for his ideals, and keep Singapore exceptional and successful for many years to come. May Mr. Lee Kuan Yew rest in peace. The government has declared a period of national mourning for seven days. State Sunday. flags on all government buildings will be flown at half mast. A private family wake will be held today and tomorrow at Sri Tamasik. Mr. Lee's body will then lie in state at Parliament House from Wednesday to Saturday for the public to pay their respects. A state funeral service will be held at 2 p.m. on Sunday at the University Cultural Centre, National University of Singapore. The state funeral will be followed by a private cremation at Mandai Crematorium.